Well, I see you talk about a time when uh, Turk was trying to fight Little Wayne in Miami. Yeah, I had heard about that. I think Turk had got drunk or something and ticked off of Wayne and wanted to fight Wayne. But Turk used to get mad with me when I used to tell him a story. Turk would be like, that ain't true. And I learned this, that, you know, Turk get drunk. When he used to get drunk, he'd forget a lot. You know, he would really go off. So this is the story that I was hearing from different people that's around them. I don't know for sure that it happened, but that's what I was hearing. And I was just reporting the news because I got cash money channel. So I reported the news in the midst of that Turk bad with me. Man, he running and raving, but it's good for the internet. So, and like I say, nobody take care of me. So I just say what I want to say. If I'm wrong, then I'll be down bad. I'll straighten all that later, but I said that. But nine times out of 10, when I get my stories, I'm going to get it from the in-house and it's going to be accurate. Are they still cool uh, now, Turk and Lil Wayne? Are, they re are, are the Hot Boys reuniting? Yeah, the Hot Boys going to reunite. Yes. The only two that I see that's mad with Turk is BG and Birdman. If I could see BG, Birdman, and Wayne on a picture or somewhere with Turk, then I know, yeah, they're getting together. It's, it's about to go down. It's about to, it's, it's, this is about to be real. Yeah. Who all from the Hot Boys have you talked to since you've been out? Have you talked to BG? No. Have you talked to, do you talk to Turk? Yeah. Okay. I had did an interview on Turk Channel. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, Turk flipped on me, I feel, because I did an interview on his channel. It was cool. Uh, you know, Turk got the podcast in Atlanta, and so they both used to be shouting me out, and I shot them out. And I'm like, I'm going out there to be on the channel. I left a message with one of the guys, or the owner, he answered. I left a message on Turk. He had, he had, and I had somebody contact Turk. He was like, hey, it ain't on me. It's on him. I'm like, come on, man. I'm one of the big names on YouTube. You should be on oh, ain't on you. You can get me in there, get me on there. But then I was like, all right, I was about to bring money to y'all channel. Don't forget about it. But I didn't like it because I felt like you trying to save face with Birdman and them, and you don't want to be seen like, okay, I did it once, but I ain't about to keep this. It's going to mess up my chance. And you still ain't nowhere with them two guys, Birdman and BG. So I felt like, hey, I got my own channel. It is what it is. What but I'm a speak on? No, I, ain't, I haven't talked to Juve either. I haven't talked to none of them. You know, Juvie, you know, him and Birdman are best friends. So I, the, a lot of them stance is whatever you say in stun, that's what we with. You ain't rocking with him, we ain't rocking with him. <laughs> that's what it is. I don't care. Bro, I got, the, I got my freedom. Think about this. I live in Texas, Dallas. But right now I'm out here in California. So I don't... Man, I went to Walmart, took pictures all the Walmart, just hanging out. I don't need no friends. When you interview, majority of the people you interview, how many people do you have with them when you interview them? Cam Con. No, no, no. Usually, uh, not a lot, man. You know, anywhere from one to three. But they're going to bring somebody. Probably eight. That's how, quite a few times. You'd be surprised how many people pull up just one person. It's it's. That's how I know I got a good name and people really with me and I don't be on no no f shit because mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying gangsters sometimes pull up by themselves. I'd, I'd be surprised as hell. Like, damn, you came by yourself? Well, shit. How many people that I came with? Me know that, that I got a good name. How many people I came with and I don't know you? Zero. <laughs> <laughs> so sad. So it's it, not for real. And that shows, like you say, a lot about I've never heard no bad stuff. Oh, man, you go mess with Capone, man. You're going to come out the bushes on. They're going to beat you. Da, da, da. I never heard that kind of stuff. So me, I like to travel. I like to travel solo because it keeps down. I know when bad day come, I don't got to worry about me recording myself and exposing myself. I don't have to worry about nobody getting jealous because I'm on big platform. You know, a lot of people feel like they're happy for you, but be hating sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes a lot of people don't want to see you win. That smile that they be smiling, that's not a happy smile. That's a smile. I can't wait till you go down. I can't wait till you fall. Yeah. See, I know the genuine one. The genuine one, the, the ones that are really genuine with me, I know them.
What's up? This is Cam Capone. We got more content like this coming soon. So hit that like button, subscribe, and stay locked in to Cam Capone News.